Hi. My Whirlpool Cabrio washer is giving an error code, F5E1. Can I fix this on my own? Do I need to buy a new lock? What happened just before your Whirlpool washer displayed this message? I turned it on and I couldn't select anything on the touchscreen. It was acting as if it was locked. It would beep twice every time I touched any button. So I looked up how to perform a diagnostic. How long has this been going on with your Whirlpool washer? What have you tried so far? Happened yesterday. I took lid off and took the lock apart. I cleaned the little contact pads with a little alcohol. And then put a little grease back on there. But still didn't work. Anything else we should know to help you best? No. Please read my entire post. My name is Woody. I'm sorry to hear that you're having issues. I'm also be assisting you along with other customers so there may be a delay in responses to do not panic just wait for my reply. Note, the website will send you a prompt for a phone call and pop UPS those are not for me, so if you do not want me to call you then please ignore IT. May I please have the unit's full model number? The model number is the lid at the rear of the opening on top loaders. If you open the washer lid, the model slash serial tag is at the rear of the opening on the washer itself. Model number is. Thank you. Give me a few minutes to pull up information on this model. I am also assisting you along with other customers so there may be a delay in responses to do not panic just wait for my reply. Sounds good. Thank you. The error code of F5E1 means lid switch fault. Do you have a volt ohm meter and know how to use it? Do be able to do any resistance and voltage testing? I have one. But don't really know how to use it. If you tell me how, I'll be able to figure it out. Lol. Okay you will need to unplug the lid switch from the control board on the J6 connector and with your meter set it to ohm scale and test the white wire T the blue wire for continuity with the lid open and test with the lid closed you should only get continuity with the lid closed if you get no continuity at all either lid open or closed, then you will need to replace the lid switch itself. The YouTube video of cleaning and lubricating the switch does not always work. I will get you a link to the lid switch so if you need it you will have it. The link below is to the part you will need from a highly recommended company rated A plus with the Better Business Bureau. They offer a 100% money back guarantee, for an entire year. And offer a full 1 year warranty. Dash click here. Always glad to assist you anytime. Thank you in advance. If you need me again for any other issues you can request me. Master Tech And even after you rate me today if you have a question just reply back to me. I will still assist you, no extra charges. But rating me 5 stars is the only way I get paid for my time. I do not get compensated until you rate me. You should see a rating box above and to the right of the text box where you are replying back to me and, just click on the rating box and it will open the rating window for you to then rate me. Thank you. Woody. Okay. Sounds good. I have to find my meter. 
But thank you for the information. If I have any more questions I will get back in touch. Thanks again. No need to reply back thank you and glad to assist you anytime. Have a safe rest of the week and weekend. Woody. Hi Woody. I checked continuity and there is continuity when the lid is open and when it's closed. What does that mean? As I stated yesterday. Okay you will need to unplug the lid switch from the control board on the J6 connector and with your meter set it to ohm scale and test the white wire T the blue wire for continuity with the lid open and test with the lid closed you should only get continuity with the lid closed if you get continuity or no continuity at all either lid open or closed, then you will need to replace the lid switch itself. The YouTube video of cleaning and lubricating the switch does not always work. And I sent you the link fr the part, do you need that again also? I bought the part from the website you referred. I assumed your advice was the same if continuity was present for both lid open and closed. Thank you so much again. Yes that is correct. Woody. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.